Boys, be honest, this kit probably drifts better than you. Don't lie to me. Man has a full setup as well, 900 degree steering wheel over there, pulling the handbrake as well, has a shift to three pedals bro, and he's in a tandem. Let me tell you this, this kit is going places, okay? Maybe even FD, we don't know. Possibly next Adam LZ. Kia is someone who calls himself the Blue Angel, and he has a setup as well, 900 degrees Thrustmaster setup over there. I think that's the eBay handbrake drifts a Lambo in Forza Horizon 5 in reverse. I don't know what's up with reverse drifting lately. I see that everywhere. Here is a professional FD run. If you guys have watched Formula Drift, this is the Long Beach run. And bro, the camera is so good. It's like an actual GoPro mounted on the roof of the car. I love it. And bro, they're so tight there. So tight. Very good runs. So here is outside view as well. They were not actually drifting alone. This is Forza Horizon 5. There seems to be a truck doing a 360 entry. And I think the truck has a weave livery. That's just disappointing. Ooh. I need a second to figure out what game that is. I uh, said, of course, I think. And bro, there is a female driver in the car. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that. Oh yes, bro. When was the last time we saw a GTA 5 clip like decent drifting in GTA 5? I don't remember. It's always some weird jump drifts. But this is the Oiwarf map. And again, this man is drifting in reverse. What's up with that? <laughs> and now the hardest drift game ever. BMNG. The devil himself invented this game. And he seems to be drifting the Nissan S13. Inside view as well over here. This man is actually using his mouse to steer. If you look at his monitor, he's actually in first person view. And he says, Sampti Goose. Yeah, if you do, then you will become a Giga Chad. Yeah. As said, of course, that the track is called Sunrise Circuit. There is a lot of people here. Man, through a 360 entry. There's other people over here as well. He lets one of them pass and gets into a tandem. And here is a jump drift in AC. Porsche Horizon 5, once again, we have a Nissan S15 over here flexing with a 360 and again in reverse, bro. What is up with reverse drifting nowadays? What is it? It's too much. Mr. Lofus over here drifting in first person view in a set of Corsa, as pro drifters usually do. Let me glance at his setup. I think that's a Logitech G29. And another fellow wheel drifter in Carex. It's nice to meet you. I wish I knew your name, but he did do a 360 with no assist in Carex. That is actually pretty impressive. This car looks to be a Volvo 360 from the front, I'm not sure. Nope, it is not a Volvo, it is something different. I don't even know what this is. Bro, my lord, look at them graphics. The road looks so wet. I love when the road is wet. The weather, the better, as my grandma always said. What? Anyway, uh, here is a dude who is raising up his arm through the windshield there. Did you guys see that? While drifting, bro. Let's see if we can check it out again. His arm is still hanging out the window. And I think he had a passenger as well. Here is... Wait, is that the Slap Train's car? No, wait. Slap Train had G35. This one is G37, right? But hey, man did a 360. And this is Initial Unity, the game that was inspired by the anime Initial D. Ladies and gentlemen, live for speed. Only the boomers know this game. Well, actually, I haven't played that game, but I will get to it, okay? All I know is, is a free game, but if you want to unlock like drift cars, then you gotta pay. I'm not even sure how many people still play this game. This man is playing solo. Here is a VR clip boys, virtual reality. Check it out in first person view, I'm sure it is a wonderful experience. I mean, for us, it looks really shaky, right? But bro, look how close you can get with VR. By the way, those mirrors are completely useless. Another wheel player. Bro, we have so many wheel cams today, thank you. We love wheel cams. The car he's whipping is a BMW E36 wagon. Bro, he has a deep dish steering wheel over there on a Thrustmaster base. Alright, I'm sorry. Motorcycle, how did you get in here? The game is the crew too, alright? He's trying to pull a wheelie. Okay, he's doing it. I mean, that is a magnificent wheelie. Oh, he's avoiding traffic. Oh, Jesus. That looks really dangerous. So that's why you're here. Okay, man did a 360 on a motorcycle, bro. All right, I've never seen that before. And here is what the kids nowadays call a... I don't know why. It's cringe. I'm not saying that. And suddenly, a tandem in a set of corner. Check it out. I even know this map. I'm so bad at memorizing map names, but this map has a really good layout for tandems. Yeah, tandems, always good. Oh, boy. Is that a Civic? Yeah, that's a Civic. Um, I guess that Civic needed a little bit more traction than usual. 
Added a couple extra tires over there. I mean, can't wait to see it drift. It looks really wiggly, like really bouncy. It's struggling to go straight. I think that he's a corner ahead, so let's check it out. He's uh, <laughs> bouncing around like crazy over here. I'm surprised it ain't falling apart. I think that's like 16 tires, if my math is correct. And here's a corner and... Wow. Bro, all those tires and no grip mission failed successfully here is another leap for speed clip but we have a cop chase so we uh i don't think that is a feature in the game i think the cop is another player and s15 seems to be winning cop is actually falling behind never mind this car looks dope is that the box hole brand i'm not sure it's a pretty unusual car seems to be rare with drive and it drifts pretty good here is a keyboard player over here doing a 360 between traffic very clean we have a wheel cam clipping car accent bro look at this map this is an actual living room inspired by hot wheels map i played on this map in a set of corsa but this is the car x version of the same map we've been on a logitech g29 here is i believe forza a little overdrive drive beast this reminds me rallycross rallycross is my favorite motorsport by the way another wheel cam clip bro so many i love it he's doing the abyssal jump let's skip forward to the actual jump let's check it out he's doing it he's looking good and he did it okay that is impressive one week into drifting Bro, every new player starts with Drift Playground in a set of cars, I swear. <laughs> it's always Drift Playground. Everyone knows that map. This is FR Legend. But this is modded. This is a custom map. I don't think he's playing this on mobile. Unless you can mod mobile. The map looks cool. Yeah. Bruh. Really, out of all the vehicles, you chose a three-wheel car. It's really weird seeing it sideways, but he did it. And here is some juicy graphics. Gran Turismo, I believe, right? A very stock-looking Nissan S13. Stock rims as well. Well, too bad PC gamers can't play this. Really? Okay. A Formula 1 car. Okay, alright, let's check it out. It looks awfully slippery. The game is a set of Forza. And now he switched the map and obviously a Drift Playground. If there's one map Drift is no, it's Drift Playground. And he's here. Alright, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know this map. And whoa! He flashed his lights, his pop-up lights at us. By the way, what is the map? This game is Overdrift Festival. Bro, this game got a huge update recently. They fixed the desync, they added a new map area. This game is going places. Trust Master T300. Here is a Supra, but this Supra is drifting on a boat. Well, I think it's an aircraft carrier. And boys, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe, like, and as always, stay sideways.